evening everyone, there we go, <laughs> uh, we, welcome back to another Trenton World free live stream, we are back on the Brighton main line uh, this evening and we're going to be doing a free bridges to London Victoria service, it won't be the longest of streams, probably about 40 minutes or so, 40-45 uh, minutes pushing it, uh, anyway we've got NG, Luke, Davidoff, Pep and Aussie Dog, how are you all doing, hopefully you're all well, do let me know about audio as well, don't want the game being too quiet. Uh, but let's get the train set up. Uh, let's do that. Do that. Hello, Nabil. Welcome back. Hello, Senseless and Brandon. I'm um, all good, Brandon. Hopefully, you're all well. Let's get that on. There we go. Do a bit of that. There we go. And now we wait. <laughs> um, oh, and the headlights, which sometimes I forget to do. There. Hello, Bills. Yeah, now we've got an eight coach service. Get a nice uh, screenshot as well. I do need a thumbnail for uh, 377. You're new, uh, unless you've uh, yeah, unless you've forgotten. <laughs> Welcome back. Very long time you've been here. Still no. Oh, what was that? That'll be Gatwick Airport next. Right, there you go. Let's go. So, will we be going? Yes, we are going to be going on to the up fast. Just a chilled out day, fair enough. And there we go. Cross the points. Once we go. And yeah, we're going on to the uh, up fast horn. There we go, there's a bit of horn. And we can speed up to 90 once the back of the train's off the points. Yeah, well, times have changed a bit. Times have changed. Uh, good bills? Uh, well, I suppose so, yeah. Yeah, I suppose so. Um, yeah, someone said Transport Fever 2 is coming to console. So that'll be uh, cool. Oh, it is, yeah. Ah, that'll be cool. February 2023. I look forward to that. Not bad. Getting that up. Does. It's confirmed, nice. Is it on the PlayStation Store already? So sort of, you know, saying it, it's announced or it's coming soon. Hello Josh, you're doing an Express London to Brighton itself. New to the channel, welcome. Yeah, welcome. Um do you work at Brighton to us? I've been to Brighton a couple of times, yeah, helping out with the football. Um, so I guess yeah. Yes, it unexpected, isn't it? You wouldn't think Transport Fever Two would come to console. So I would have thought they would have just sort of kept it on PC and it would sort of just well stay there. But yeah, coming to console. I suppose that would be competition for Railway Empire Two in a way. Depending on when that comes out, try and show off both. Looking forward to Railway Empire 2 and, well, I suppose now Transport Fever 2 on there. Hello, Radio, how are you? Uh, well, yes, Josh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, most definitely. 
Maybe one day. Hello, Kieran. <laughs> How you doing? So not too many stops on this service, just Gatwick, East Croydon, Clapham Junction in London, Victoria. Here we are. There we go. Uh, probably Nabil. All the other maps are pretty, well, not too good. So yeah, probably. Not really too interested in the other stuff. If it was like new then maybe, but I think the British maps probably are sort of the best ones on there, quality wise. Is there even German map German map modders for OMSI or oh, we got a three eight seven, she's just behind us. Uh probably not Kieran. Yeah, probably not. Hello little Tigger. It's a little bit well not far, about about an hour's drive. Well a bit less than that, but no, probably not. I'll just visit it instead. <laughs> Maybe that's not the West Coast way. Oh, and West Coast way. Maybe. Uh, we are doing service 1 Charlie 19. Oh, I've seen the bell. Hello, Joseph. How are you? And we're off. Yeah, it won't be 9 o'clock. I'll be on... Uh, Red Dead probably quarter to ten. So just expect me to go on there then. Ian Theo, just finished shift, I'm all good, hopefully you're all well. What are you up to today, Theo? Were you contemplating the Route 22 change, or yeah, what are you up to? Do Cathcart Circle, uh, maybe at some point, Fife. If I ever come down that way, Theo, I'll have to go on the buses. I bet like, Theo did that, he made it go down that road. Can you stream Red Dead? I was thinking about it, um, but probably not. Oh, that's coming up. Yeah, I've got to record a Train Sim World video off. This will be about 10 minutes. Um, yeah, 10 minute long, 10 15 minutes long. Any ideas? Any liveries you've got which you want me to do a livery review on? You're from Northern Ireland. We have a decent railway system, beautiful views. Yeah, I think, was it London Derry to Belfast? Um, obviously, that on TV programmes. That looks beautiful along that. Got the cliffs and stuff. <laughs> That'll be cool, uh, Kieran. Awesome, uh, quick out. Yeah, it's a brilliant game. Uh, they don't. Well, Rockstar pretty much just said we're not updating online anymore. You know, there's not going to be any big, big updates anymore, which is a bit of a shame. Then I suppose it's all about profit, isn't it? And, well, GTA. They're all about that. But it's a very nice, and story mode's great as well. Same with online. Although I do find it annoying the way on Red Dead Online you still can't buy your own house somewhere. It's like, really? Obviously, you probably never will be able to because, well, they're not going to be updating it. I do a little tick. Actually, you remind. I need to update the uh, "What am I doing?" section for last week. I always forget to do it. It's just a customer service uh, job. It's a, it's a start. Good money as well. And get to work at a train station, it's not bad. Now, nah, unfortunately, hopefully they do reverse that decision, but probably not. Hello, Paul, welcome in. Welcome back. 
you've been updating Green Road for some buses as soon as some have been a bit sensitive recently and have been assessing the route change and all the timetable and effects it will have. Lovely for you. It's awesome. Is Red Dead dead? Uh, I mean, yeah, people say on Red Dead Redemption 2 it's a dead game. Well, not really. I mean, yeah, Rockstar might think it's a dead game and not updating it, but there's still a lot of life, a lot of players on it, a lot of life. Most of the time I'm on it, I'm just terrorising the NPCs. <laughs> Yeah, it's looks like it's good. Nothing for this weekend, though. First weekend, well, there's been absolutely nothing since, well, since I started it. So a little bit annoying, but I suppose it meant a day out in London. Do I like bus sim? Bus sim's okay, uh, but I'm not the biggest fan. I preferred bus sim 18 to bus sim 21. Hello, Ben. Isn't train somewhere getting boring for you? Uh, I mean, at times it can be a bit like, oh, I don't really want to play it at the moment, I want to go on something else. But most of the time, it's 90% uh, of the time, it's, yeah, let's get on it and let's play. But yeah, sometimes it is sort of mm, just a normal job digger. Hello, Maze. Yeah, I'm all good. Hopefully, you're all well. Yeah, I'd say 90% of the time, I'm like, yeah, let's get on TSW, let's play. And sort of that other ten percent, it's sort of like well, I don't really want to play it on stream today, but I'm committed to doing it, so we'll do it. War Thunder, yeah, I've seen that game advertised for absolutely years. I'm always sort of same with that World of Tanks one. I'm always like halfway through downloading it, and then I'm just like, nah. Yeah, that's amazing. good. But the thing to minimise that 10% is to keep bringing out, you know, new DLC, that then, yeah, makes it much easier to play. Can't wait to have the HST into 7 City livery on Train Sim World 3, or some 5. Uh, Green Road is a system where if a bus driver who does something a little bit wrong, going around the corner too fast or breaking too sharp, it will give them an event. Too many events will result in a man oh, bloody hell, manager meeting, I'm guessing. And to make it fair, we need to keep making sure that isn't too sensitive so drivers don't keep getting events. Um. The bus actually tracks what you do. It's just like, if you go around the corner too fast, it's like, right. That's a, that's a, that's a strike. How nosy. <laughs> Hello, I finally finished work. It was crazy today, although the swelling is gone. You're still in. Oh, bloody, I'm not good, uh, Adam. Fair enough. What bus route were you on today? Maybe I was near you. I was between King's Cross and Regent's Park today. Anywhere along there. Yeah, it didn't work today, Adam. They had absolutely nothing available today. You regret buying a train somewhere free? You never really play it. Not even for Castle Versberg. Thought you'd be all over that. Cheers, Josh. Yeah, we've almost got a thousand people on the Discord server, it's mad. Hello Railway Guy, if Trains in World have the West Coast Main Line, they should have the BR390 Pendolino train. I mean, if they did the West Coast Main Line South, I'd very highly likely they would put the 390 on there. As it's at the staple of the West Coast Main Line. How could you not have the 390 on there? If the free, uh, if the West Coast Mainland released, it shouldn't be. No, it's not permit. It's just the uh, lighting from the passenger compartments. Uh, I believe it is still an issue, or still a glitch, or lighting bug, whatever it's called. Where's the next ATS convoy? Not sure. It's been quite a while since the last one. Tomorrow we'll have a few streams. I don't know what we'll be doing. Um, but tomorrow there will be a uh, a few. 
Probably two or three. Probably three. Depending on how long the one and two are. Hey, Jake, how are you? I saw you doing your train sim today at King's Cross. Now I was going to come over and you'd vanished. He was in West London around White City bus station. Nice, Adam. Sounds good. Uh, little tick. I shall have a look now. It's just an easy bit, this bit, as we whiz along. And uh, that? Uh, let's see. How about did you send me that on? That general, I'm guessing. Uh, what did you DM me? Where, where's that? Can't see anything on there at the moment. Your mince pies are tight. Just the tunnel, yeah. Uh, have it. Nothing to worry, as it's just to make sure that drivers aren't hammering the brakes constantly or going around the corners way too fast. If you're sensible, all is fine. I don't see fear. Told me yesterday it was 40 neurons were showing. Ooh. Good, Jay. It was a great day at King's Cross today. It was good on TS and Joy Planet for the first time. Awesome. Yeah, I was going to come over and then I, I, I turned around, you were like gone. Hello, Schindler, how are you? Oh, they, they vanished. That would be cool, real train driver, that would be cool. I wouldn't mind being a bus driver. They keep, um, they've got like a massive promotion at the moment around here. Just like you should, like, I know, it's like I'm a skier, I'm a builder, I'm a bus driver. <laughs> Little things like that, it's funny. Um, yeah, I wouldn't mind being a bus driver, but I definitely do prefer the railway over buses, so. Be fun though. Hello, Schindler. Yeah, good to see you, I'm all good. Hello, Eagle. How are you? Maths test next week. Oh, God. Well, good luck with that. Awesome, Nabil. Oh, you did DM me. You went to London Bridge, uh, had to shoot off for the train. Fair enough. Saturday timetable like in England, very frequent still. Yeah, nothing for... Oh, message requests, that's new. Message requests. No, just accept it. Oh, that looks cool. Uh, little tick. Is that Munich? Yeah, is that Munich station? That's cool. Go ahead. Go ahead here as well, actually. Awesome. You driving that today or working at the station? Give you a little wave as well. There you go. Uh, not today, you're going to, not today. Hello, Steve, how are you? Do I like Electro Stars? I do love Electro Stars. <laughs> I see Permian. Around here, they're pretty um, reliable. I've never had a bus sort of disappear on me. Almost did. That's a panic. It was, it was good for you. Yeah, it was good. Saw Jamie from Dovetail Games there and Dovetail Games Cat and played Train Sim on unreleased DLC. One of our trains every 30 minutes expects the London Derry line every hour due to the one way track. I mean, that's fair enough. Still pretty good frequency though. Oh, also, oh yeah, I remember that little Sega. Yeah, I remember you mentioned that quite a while back. So and, uh, you'd managed to uh, sort of get in with them. Awesome. Oh, lovely. So whereabouts the go ahead run then? So if, uh, yeah, whereabouts do they run? That almost looks like a four two nine that train. Mine's been the one from Frankfurt to uh, Koblenz. <laughs> no, a Dovetail Games cat. Uh, yes, yeah, not an actual cat. Uh, I don't know. I was. Uh, that's weird you mentioned that because I was thinking about doing one today. I was like, I really want to bloody make a scenario on the Sutton and Mole Valley lines. Um, 
So yeah, maybe at some point. I would like to. That's a bit tricky doing it on stream. And it also hurts your eyes because there's no night mode. On, I wish there was a night mode on real time trains. As you sort of keep going over to it, and you get the blare of white in your face, and it's like, oh, your eyes. It's annoying. Real time trains. Make a night mode if there's not already one. Uh, celebrating uh, the Flying Scotsman being there. Oh, let's see, Adam. No, it's not too bad, Josh. I mean, it could be worse. Yeah, you should definitely go and have a look, Steve. It's definitely worth um, going up there if you're in London. I think they're dovetail there tomorrow. Yeah, that'd be awesome announcements. Maybe Permian. It hurts your eyes on that real time trains. So obviously when you're not streaming you can have all the lights off and you don't have to keep sort of flicking over to it as much. But yeah. Did hurt my eyes a little bit last time doing it. Yes. <laughs> Heard of Matt P, yeah, it's Matt. Uh, we'll get their routes in Munich to Um, Versburg, Allen, uh, Donner, Worth, Fire, the Schnell, Fashion Comics, Augsburg. Oh, lovely. Oh, good for you, little Tigger, mate. Sounds like you're enjoying it. It does, yeah, on real time trains. Well, when I'm streaming and looking at the train sim and that at the same time. Oh, actually, no, hang on. No, because we'll have it on the tablet. So, no, we might we'll be alright, actually. Yeah, when we were making a train sim world scenario and we had real time trains on the main PC screen, it was hurt my eyes a bit. But no, yeah, if we're on the PC uh, and the tablet's got it up, we might be alright. Scratch that, yeah. Maybe. As I want to make one for the Sutton and Mulvaddy diners, there's not really many scenarios for it. So yeah, maybe we'll do that tomorrow. Fair enough for you. Well, that's because see when you're looking at both screens quicker and then you get the blare of the white at you from real time trains, it's like whoa. Obviously flicking between the YouTube dark mode and real time trains. Better if on the tablet will be alright. See it maybe. Maybe. Well, I guess so, Nabil. Oh, yeah, for YouTube. I don't really play. I don't play TSW much off stream. So when I'm playing it on stream, is is like my time playing it in the day. I only really play it off stream when there's something new out, and I sort of just want to keep getting on it and playing it and playing it and playing it and playing it. Playing it. <laughs> Fair enough, uh, Quicko. Did I spot any buses today? A lot of London buses. Boris bus, tons of them. I think a couple of Evo cities, Enviro 400, street decks, a lot. And also a single decker, which is almost like one of those hydrogen cell buses. I don't know if they still have them. They had like, the big thing on top. So about 60 buses. Just a few then. Yeah, it's uh, I hate light mode. There's always got to be a dark mode, but real time train doesn't have one. So when you're trying to look at two screens at once and you keep flicking over from dark to light, it just yeah, hurts your eyes. But if it's on the tablet I can put the brightness right down. So um well, that's good. But yeah, maybe it would do once, we'll see. Yeah, definitely want to make a scenario for the Sutton and Mole Valley. Cause there's not many on there. 34 buses. So how many routes do you have to manage, uh, Theo? Yeah, we get to London Victoria and that will be it. So, not the longest of streams tonight. 
Um, but the last one did overrun a little bit by about 10 minutes. Probably that one, Adam. You call it the Duracell bus. Yeah, it was on a route past uh, Houston, so whatever that one would have been. Can't remember, 214? No. That might have been, yeah, the 214, possibly. I saw the 18, I saw what I've wanted to see. Many more, the 390. Tons of other ones. The 18. Yeah, see you, little ticket. Thanks for uh, coming in, mate. Take care. Enjoy your training. There's not really much to see in the bill. Oh, we've run about 20 turbuses. Nice. Lovely five. Yeah, sounds good, Permin. Oh, good idea. Oh, that is a good idea. <laughs> I was gonna say if if, um, if I make one on Sutton Mole Valley, if I make one on the Sutton Mole Valley line, you could do one in the opposite direction, the next service after. That's what. Yeah, depends what you whatever you want to do, really. See you, Paul. Thanks for coming in, mate. That's what I'd do. Is I'd do what they did today. Uh, Hall, well, I suppose maybe well Dorking to London Bridge. Because then you don't have to do all of the AI at Victoria, which completely killed TS last time we did it. So it actually would be a good day to do it tomorrow, because then real-time trains has all the data still. But yeah, take care, Paul. Fair enough here. It's Microsoft. I've never tried that before on Word. Hello, LH. What did I answer? What do you mean? Yeah, I think they were going via Hackbridge today. No, I didn't go to Dorking today, no. But trains were... The ones up from Horsham were going Horsham to London Bridge via Hackbridge today. Um, the usual ones up to London, Victoria. Oh, do you have to pay for the bus licence? Wouldn't the company pay for, it, pay for you to learn it, Theo? Maybe if you ask nicely... Bring him a pack of biscuits and be like, you know what, can you get me the license? <laughs> Fair enough here. Is it new buses down there or is it fairly old buses like Renowns and stuff? Oh, there's not really much to see in the bill. So it's just a desk and two monitors and a tablet and two keyboards. So yeah, not, not a lot to see. And lots of coasters just all over the place. Various teas and stuff. Yeah, has anyone got any liveries on the Creators Club you want me to uh, do as a video? Because I've got to do one after this, and it'll be probably about 10 minutes max. Or 15 minutes max. And uh, so have you got any liveries you want me to have a look at? Well, feel free to pop them in the chat now. Smudge has been sleeping outside. Well, outside my room, not outside, outside. Uh, yes, yeah, she's been there. Who got one's worth comment? That is Charity Amanda. That's stuff for. Do a depot service. That's not that exciting though, is it really? I mean, some are quite exciting just to go down little tracks and stuff, but. The darts and trident. So nice. And here we are. Oh, lovely, Aussie. Someone's actually, someone did make me a 387. I still haven't got around to checking it out yet. 
need to find like a stopping 387 service. Cathcart Depot, done that before. Now we're coming into Clapham Junction. Lovely. Cool. And then after this stream, we'll be back tomorrow. And yeah, I think we we probably will do some train simulator scenario creating. Do one for the Sutton and Mole Valley line. Probably, we probably won't complete it on the stream, although I'm sure we'll get a fair way through. Well, we'll see. You should do OMPSI. Probably do OMPSI tomorrow. I'm not going to promise it, but I would like to do it tomorrow. Another game we need to get back to again is the bus. Well, I really just waiting for the e Sitaro on there. I only really play the bus when there is a new update. Yeah, waiting for the e Sitaro, then we can run it on the uh, 300, which it well goes on in real life. Yeah, possibly Theo. I don't want to promise it, but likely. Well, I keep thinking it's Monday tomorrow as well, but it's Sunday, so yeah, we'll see. It's on Monday, I've got more time than tomorrow. Let's go. What bus am I thinking of? Um, could do fair. Uh, probably. Oh my god. Oh my. What the hell is like an invisible train? <laughs> that was bizarre. Um, hmm, what bus tomorrow? Streetlight, I think. Yeah, I might go on the streetlight. It is. It is. She's fair. Yeah, it's Cottrell. Up to the university. Yeah, it's a nice, uh, nice map that one. Just wish they extended it a bit more. It's lovely. Another service up there. Uh, maybe at some point, Davidoff. Yeah, maybe at some point. Well, that'd be quite hard to show that on stream. Can I speak French? Uh, no. I did. Sp I did learn a little bit of French um, in like junior school, but I was never really interested in it. Um, and then we started. And then I started learning Spanish, which I'm, I'm interested in. Awesome, Theo. You like the new stop and go via location picture? Maybe. Oh, see if they're... Looks like we're not cleared into Victoria. Oh, we are now. Oh, we're cleared in. Just this one, yeah, just this one, the bill. Fair enough, yeah. 
Uh, don't know, Davidoff. Yeah, there's a free set. Hey, there's Paul as well. How are you doing, Paul? Hopefully you're all well, mate. Just about to end. It's only a short one tonight. Got my takeaway curry coming in about probably 10 minutes. How are you doing, Paul? If anyone here hasn't checked out Paul's channel, do go and check him out. Train Simulator Driver. A fellow um, Dovetail Ambassador. There's a 465. Yeah, here we are, Victoria. Put that down. So yeah, just a short TSW run tonight as the last one did go a little bit longer than what I thought it might uh, on Train Simulator. Yes, Paul. With onion barges, Papa Doms, a whole lot. Sure does, uh, quick at sure does. There we are. I don't think a route can beat this route for me. I, d I, d I don't know. I don't think it could. Unless it's maybe, you know, West Coast way or something like that. I mean, East Coast, Main Line, South. That would get very close to overtaking this route, sort of as my favourite. Yeah, I don't think anything will ever beat this. But then there's a lot of bias as I go on the Brighton Main Line a lot. It's, one that, it's my local Main Line. So it's quite hard to be beaten. If they did the Aaron Valley line, that might come close. Yeah, maybe Dav yeah, possibly Davidoff. Yeah, good to you, all good, Paul. Paul, you should get the plane over. Go to King's Cross. It'd only take you probably a day to get over. And here we are. This is uh, London Victoria. Our final stop. Don't like third rail route, so boy, oh, bloody hell, but fair enough. Fair enough. Well, I'm the complete opposite, I love them. <laughs> but then I do live in third rail territory, so I'm going to say that. There we go. Well, uh, that is going to be it, everyone, uh, for today's Train Sim World free live stream. Hopefully, everyone has enjoyed that. That was three bridges up to London, Victoria. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't sound too bad, Paul. I mean, you probably get over and. Yeah. <laughs> uh, there we go. Not bad. But yeah, uh, thanks all for coming in. Links can be found in the usual places to the Discord, to the PayPal, and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. Apart from that, thanks all for coming in. Have a lovely rest of your evening, and hopefully we'll see you in the next one. See you all, and take care. Bye, guys.